This is Peter from beachtravel.com and allinclusivecarbonecruises.net. We're done here at uh, Princess Keys and we're actually on the last tender back to the Crown Princess. So the crew members who were working on the island to make us comfortable are on this tender as well as all their equipment. And the last few passengers, including myself, are on this tender. So we're heading back to ship. So by uh, Princess Keys until some other time. Really was a good stay here. Um, I actually spent most of my day in the water. I just enjoy the Caribbean Sea. Well, this is not really the Caribbean Sea; it's more the Atlantic Ocean. But anything outside the U.S. Well, I shouldn't say that because I do love beaches on the Gulf side of the U.S. Well, as you know, what I mean, anything south of um, the U.S., I really enjoy going to the beach there. So it was a great day. That is a beach area over there. Certainly was a great day on the beach. Well, so long, uh, Princess Keys, and here we go. It's Crown Princess coming up. Should be about a five minute ride or so. I've only been in one two, uh, two years ago, and I, re I really enjoyed that cruise, surprisingly. But it was really a good cruise. Are you here today with a big family? Yeah, there's a group of us here, there's 13 of us. Yes, um, my family and some friends.
this is our final approach. Going around to the other side of the ship. As you can tell, the Crown Princess is really a big uh, ship. I think it's over 110 uh, tons in weight. Over 110. We've been on ships 110, 101,000 and uh, smaller. This is one of the biggest we have been on, if not the biggest. It's really humongous, great ship. It's beautiful inside too. So here we are, about to go to where we disembark and we will get aboard, enjoy the evening and look forward to tomorrow's day at sea. This is Peter from PeachTravel.com and All Inclusive Caribbean Cruises saying until the next video, go have fun and see you on the high seas. Bye.